Now that your TV is out of the box, let's install the stand and get connected. Here's what you'll need. The four stand legs, the stand guide, the power cable, the cable holder, and cable guide. To prevent the TV from tipping over, make sure you have a friend hold it while you install the stand. Since the stand legs go in at an angle, be sure to use the stand guide to help when attaching the legs. Align the stand guide with the slot like so. Then attach the stand leg to the TV by turning it clockwise until it's securely in place. Once finished, slide the guide off. Just repeat this process for the other legs to complete the stand setup. With the help of a friend, flip the TV over and move it into place. Be sure to keep your hands on the edges and don't squeeze the TV screen directly. Now let's get connected. Have your friend lend you a hand to remove the back cover. Place one hand in the groove at the bottom and the other hand on the side. Then gently pull the cover off. Pull the power cord through the opening and plug it in. Run the cable along the groove at the bottom. Make all other connections at this time as well. You can use the provided cable guide to arrange and secure the cables to the back of the TV if you wish. Once you've made your connections, place the back cover back on. Align the notches on the back of the cover to the slots on the back of the TV and gently press it down. Make sure the sides are pushed in all the way. For a clean, sleek look, use the cable holder to securely attach the cables to the stand leg.